Wake up, warriors! Good morning, warriors. I'm Shay. And I'm Ellie. Hey, Ellie, do you have a fork? Oh, I don't have one, but let's just do the announcement, Shay. I don't want to worry about that right now. Stop eating. I guess I'll just eat with my fingers. Anyways, we don't have a mystery winner from last week because we are at our high school. We're all winners this week. Be specific on where we're, your guess is this week. Be a specific road we need to know or we won't accept your guess. <laughs> and be sure to check out the tennis and the baseball games this week. They're both home, so let's go support some people. My friend says I'm not cool. But he said wrestling a bear is cool. I'm gonna go do that. that you need to get your community service hours into Miss Bird this week. Graduation is coming up, so you need to get them in. And remember, prom is coming up April 20th. I know you're all excited for it. It's at Flynn Flock Hall. You know where it's at. It's in Albany. We'll see you there. All right, I wanted to take this opportunity to inform you about a positive change for next year. Um, we're going to be able to put in a new policy where we have school uniforms. All the students are wearing school uniforms next year and uh, there's research that supports that cutting down on bullying and improving student achievement um, through this one simple change of you guys changing your attire for school. So we're real excited about this opportunity and want to inform you now so that you'd be ready uh, as you choose your clothing for next year. The district office supports the high school in this change. Uh, the, when other high schools have made moves like this towards school uniforms, they've seen an increase in student uh, achievement and a decrease in negative student behaviors. So we're behind them 110%. May the fourth be with you!